Singer R. Kelly facing growing criticism for his history of sexual harassment over his career. And now two women are making new allegations against the Chicago entertainer. ABC 7's Sarah Schulte has more. Sexual abuse allegations have followed R. Kelly for almost three decades, yet the Chicago-born R&B superstar's career continues to hum along. It even flourished after his 2008 acquittal of child pornography charges. The music industry is sadly complicit in not uh, having a reckoning for this artist. Jim DeRogata says Kelly's day of reckoning is long overdue. The music writer has been writing about sexual abuse allegations against Kelly for years. Today, DeRogatis wrote a lengthy piece in BuzzFeed about more allegations from women who say they were abused by Kelly as teenagers. In addition, DeRogatis interviewed parents who say their children are being held by Kelly. These young women, according to five parents who are on the record now, are being held in a situation where they're told when to eat, when to sleep, how to dress, how to pleasure him in encounters he records. While Kelly adamantly denies the allegations, a movement to mute him is gaining momentum. Hashtag Mute R. Kelly was started last year by Georgia activist Kenyette Tisha Barnes. This is not about R. Kelly. This is about addressing an unspoken reality of sexual violence in our community. Barnes says the goal is to bring down Kelly economically. The movement is responsible for canceling 10 R. Kelly concerts, including one tomorrow night at the UIC Pavilion. With many Hollywood celebrities on board, hashtag Mute R. Kelly is hoping radio stations and streaming services stop playing the artists. Meantime, D. Rogata says he'll continue to report on the allegations until law enforcement takes them seriously. I don't think it ends until uh, uh, his career is taken away uh, and, and uh, those girls are home. In a statement responding to Jim DeRogatis' BuzzFeed story, R. Kelly's management team says they deny the many dark descriptions put forth by instigators and liars who have their own agenda for seeking profit and fame. R. Kelly also compared the mute R. Kelly movement to a public lynching. And three Chicago radio stations continue to play his songs. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.